Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Lex and today I'm going to be walking you guys through my current morning routine. It's going to be a realistic morning routine. I don't wake up at 5 a.m. every single morning, only on mornings when I can. Um, obviously super tired at <laughs> 5 in the morning. Um, this morning I was really cold so I decided to put a robe on to make it a cozy morning. And then the very first thing that I do is I oil pull just basically swishing some coconut oil around in my mouth. The benefits of that is it brightens your teeth, it also prevents cavities, reduces inflammation, um, treats bad breath, a whole bunch of things. So I do that and I also read my daily devotional while I'm doing that and I do that for about five to 10 minutes. After that, I spit that coconut oil out in the garbage. Do not spit it out in the sink because it will clog your sink. And then I brush my teeth as normal. Usually don't take my hair out at this point, but since I was on camera, I decided I might as well. And then I just put on a headband to get my hair out of my way. And I head out to the living room to get started on my yoga. I like to light a candle, especially because it's so dark at 5 in the morning. And this is my way of romanticizing my morning routine as well. I like to listen to positive affirmations while I do my yoga because it puts me in a great mood for the day. I am unconsciously accepting all that is good. In control of my feelings, I greet this day with serenity in my mind and my body. I am focused on my goals and feel passionate about my life and my work. I'm in control of my life and I let go of stagnant, negative beliefs that have stood in the way of my happiness. Invite yourself to get into whatever position makes you feel best right now. Lovingly, invite those beautiful eyes to softly close and letting your body relax even more deeply now. After I do my yoga and meditation, I read my book. If you didn't know, I do have a book club. It's called Growth Reads. Both men and women are welcome to join. We read self-help books and focus on personal growth and development. And we meet once for each book. It's very low maintenance, but this was my way of forcing myself to be consistent with reading. So this is why I do it first thing in the morning. After I make my bloom drink, I take two big spoonfuls of sea moss. It doesn't taste good, I'll be honest, but the benefits are great. If you don't know, it helps with um, increasing your energy, healthy hair, skin, and nails. It's anti-inflammatory, eases joint pain, thyroid health, gut health, improves metabolism, and the list goes on. So that's why I take it. Bird After I shower and freshen up, I head back into the kitchen to get started on breakfast. This is me realizing that my avocado was way overripe and I was trying to figure out what to do, but I ended up making it work. I made a bacon, egg, and cheese on avocado toast. Sounds amazing, because it was. Try it. 
and then I finish getting ready for work. Seen something that you never should have been exposed to. Yeah, who I got protect you when you feel out right in danger. You know what I no, no no man, you know I'm not stranger. You want to know what you comfortable. You want to be you're comfortable. I know, no, 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 no. I know, I know, I can't let you go. I know, I know. The last thing I do in my morning routine is I make myself some tea to go and I have that along with my breakfast on my way to work. And that concludes today's video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, make sure you leave a like and a comment down below. Subscribe and hit the bell to be notified every time I upload. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.